Mr. Blockchain in the Netherlands. Uh, how was the conference for you? It was very good, thank you very much. I was very impressed also with the latest speakers from the US. Very interesting to see real life examples. And we're working on some ourselves as well, so it's very good to compare notes. Yeah, you do a lot of projects here in the Netherlands where you basically get enterprises uh, to be enthusiastic about the blockchain. Tell us about a couple of them, because IBM always speaks about clients. Absolutely. Well, I'll be very happy to mention to you that we're working with RDW at the moment, uh, Rijksdienstwegverkeer, yeah. DVLA in uh, English. And uh, we are actually doing a project there on a um, bike blockchain, bike blockchain for e-bikes in the future. Oh, really? So, And it's very interesting to see that processes work very differently once you put them in the blockchain and simplify the way you work normally. So it's, it's very promising. And we're also working with some other clients that I do not all want to uh, divulge at this moment. Okay. But is it really, do people have specific interests or are they just going like, what should we do with the blockchain? Both, both. Some people simply come to you and say, this is sexy, this is new, let's do it, which is very good because there's something coming to you and you have to you only find out what it is when you actually eat the cake, you know what it's like. Yep. And others do really have a problem, really have an issue and say, how can we solve this? And then blockchain could well be the technology of choice. Okay. And IBM really, blockchain is really important for IBM. Absolutely. It is one of our, our, our moonshot technologies, I would say. Yeah. Okay. Thank you, Louis.